Hello and welcome back to Subnautica. We are gathering. I don't know what these guys are, but this is their teeth. And I found a gold mine of them, so I can make enameled glass for my observation. Today is moving in day. We completed the. Oh, my inventory is full. Yeah. So there's the layers we finished yesterday and I don't have the moon pool yet. So the base is nowhere near completed, but we can now move everything into the other areas so it's not so cramped. This is still gonna be the food room. So the plants and extra fish and stuff like that will be in here I think I still haven't decided it might be my office for all I know the central place where I sleep every night um, we'll see but what we're gonna do is we're gonna get the stuff that's on the wall and we're moving it into the other areas so we can take these lockers down so we'll let's get the rest of this stuff I kind of just skipped over it just took a while you know to do this um, putting lockers on here so I can separate the the various uh, supplies out and put equipment or beardo stuff in here I don't know what I'm gonna put in there how I'm gonna separate it it'll get more more and more compartment compartmentalized as I go along. I do like having a lot of um, the supplies on the inside of the moon pool because when you come back with stuff, it's easier to just take it to the lockers right there. Um, so the the base is continually evolving. But I like to use all parts of it. Um, let's see, what else do we need? Um, yeah, I gotta make a fabricator to put in here. Let's see, I'll put it over here. It's hard to tell what. Oh, great. We need gold, table coral. I'll get rid of some of this stuff. Mm -hmm. So titanium goes in there. Um, we'll go ahead and put the teeth in there. The, I guess you call it the strange and odd cabinet. <laughs> teeth. That's good enough. And let's see what else is in here. Um, we got this locker to, I think it's, is it empty? Nope. Well, it's got some of the stuff that we needed. I hope I have room for it. Take as much as I can. Uh, and full. So, see, it takes a lot of trips because there's no pull function. I'm going to skip over all that boring stuff. And, and now I'm, I'm kind of dealing with the equipment. We got so many nice upgrades with that modification station. My favorite being the heat blade that actually when you kill a fish it cooks it at the same time and puts it in your inventory. It's fabulous. And it makes a nice handy weapon. I don't think I've actually killed anything except the little fish, so. Run them off. So in here we've got our modifications. We've got our uh, battery recharger. We've got a bunch of lockers for the gold and the titanium and our different materials. Make it a little bit easier. I'm sad 
though, that the signs are no longer in color. You see, you could click on the little dots on the side and you could change the colors. Like, you could have purple and blue and yellow. I don't know what happened, why they did that. If you know, or if I messed up somewhere, let me know in the comments. I would appreciate that because that was a big thing. I could go, oh, you know, titanium's always the white sign. Go straight over there. Or golden with the yellow. And I'd, I could go straight to it without even actually reading. It was a lot more visual. And now I want to look and see what's going on around my base. So I'm going to use my cameras. Has it been stolen again? Yes, once again in the teeth. I'm interested to know the scope of how far these cameras will go. If I can go all the way to the Aurora and look around, that would be awesome. But I don't, I think I just have the basic distance that it starts with. But you can upgrade how far the signal goes from, this is too many. I can't even count them. One, two, three, four, five, six, maybe. I don't know. Too many. Too many. I need to stay away from my base and stop stealing my my uh, drones. It's very irritating. There's no way that I know of to keep them away. And I've been complaining about it this whole time. I may have to go on the forums and find out if there's something anybody can do. Like electric shock every time they get close to it. And just... just that would be that would be great to add that upgrade make them shockable all right there's the live pod you see what happens as soon as you get away from the the source it starts going all staticky where distance at 350 60 So, now go backwards and go to the top here. See how far we are. From, oh, we're quite a distance from the Aurora and we have no, hardly any signal. At least not one that's worth anything. We're at 340, 350, 360 is when it gets really bad. You can still see though. I want to see how far I can go till it goes completely to getting there. 380, 390, 400, 430. See how far we are. Well, not bad, not bad. We could do way better. I want to get all the way to it. That would be great. And this is where we were earlier. One of the larger uh, debris fields by the Aurora. We need to go in the Aurora next time. Or get ready for it anyway. Um, I'm wondering what happens if it Oop, it's one of those blow up guys. I don't want it blown up. Okay, let's go back to the house. That's about as far as it goes when you lose clarity. This is pretty good. Oop, sand shark. Definitely want that upgrade. But it's funny that. Well, if he sees me, he's going to catch me. Too bad you can't train him. Huh? There's the other one. Damn it. Uh. Is he following me? Yes. Yes. Apparently he can snatch me. Switch to the other camera and we're in the mouth. It's just a plaything for these guys. Very irritating. Oh, 
hope we could lead him away, but... Ooh, more teeth. Cool. Okay. So he just puts us in the debris field. That's cool. Yeah, the range starts getting bad at th around 300, I guess. There's too many of those guys. I just... Yeah, that's the hard thing is trying to figure out what to do next. It's like, okay, do you want to prep for the trip to go to the Aurora? Do you want to handle these guys around here? Do you want to build on the base? You know, do you need to go gather materials? There's there's tons of things that you got to do. So there's really no sequence. You can play at your, you know, however you want to play. Well, I got one in there. Is the sun coming up? Looks like it. Yeah. I want to set it up so I, I use the entire base. That I go from like one end to the other and, and get and use the whole base and not have sections that are just sitting for doing nothing. I don't, I don't like that. You hear that music? Dun, 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 that sounds like something should be happening. Maybe something's going on that I don't know. Okay, so I took some samples you can eat from this tree. This is one of the things we got off the island. So that's excellent. So I filled up, you know, food and water and all that good stuff. Well, we'll see what we do next. So, I think we will end the episode here. If you like this video, please hit the like and subscribe and smash that bell to get notifications of my next upload. Thank you so much for watching. We'll talk to you later. Bye!